What the fuck is that face? What am I looking at? What is that face? Can somebody please tell me what that face is? What? Gee, that's so creepy. That's so creepy. Oh my god, I feel fucking mortified right now. What the fuck was that thing? Nightmare fuel? Absolutely. CD Project Red. Blink video. Warning, risk of seizure. Yeah, so we're probably going to go for... I don't know how long, but I do want to get as much stuff as I can done right now. So... Ooh, we might be able to finish the Delamine quest today. You know, I want to. I kind of want to finish the Delamine quest today. Midwich, nice. Have a good night, Mr. Magus. Hope to see you around again. Take it easy, take it easy. Your games go well. I'm supposed to be okay. So, what happened last time? So, I just want to bring everyone up to speed what happened last time. Um, so the stream crashed because my internet went out, but I was gra I was taking a guy's body. I was taking a body, and the body, well, I think the stream crashed right as it happened, but for reference's sake, the body's stuck up there in the ceiling. Like I shit you not, the body's in the ceiling. That's what happened last time. So, you know. We'll, uh, we'll figure, we'll figure it out. Oh, well, it worked. Padre, you gonna tell me anything? I know this isn't always easy. And that's why I applaud your decision today. Contract closed. Cool. That is... Yeah, so his body got stuck in the ceiling. Once the, the VOD goes up, you guys will see. But, yeah. Uh, we're, we're not going to question it too much, probably. Okay, so where, where are we at right now with some stuff? So there's a Delamine cab over here, and there's a Quadra type that we need to purchase. So I think we're going to do that first. Um, I don't know if there's another Delamine cab anywhere else. There's a Delamain cab over in Coast View, which we should do that. And then we're going to kind of get stuff from there. We still need to get a bunch of money to get more things, but, you know, we're going to have to see what happens. You know what? While we're on our way there, I think I'm just going to do as much as I can as we run over there. So. Um... Okay, so we have the shotgun. What are we at stats-wise right now? Annihilation, Street Brawler. I think I want to do Street Brawler, and I have my fucking gorilla arms. You don't fuck with gorilla arms, dude. You don't fuck with the man with the gorilla arms. You ever heard the right to bear arms? What about the right to gorilla arms? Let's just be real. Let's just be real. Hello! Do we want to hear about our savior, Punchy McPunterson? He's my favorite. What are you doing? Stop beating me up! Oh, dude, I just punched him in the dick. 
What did you say? Alright, cool. He's dead. And that guy's dead body. Dude, a fucking legendary is out there? Let's go. Let's fucking go. But yeah, we'll just kind of knock things out as we get there. Um, so we got another thing over here. Max Burst is pretty good. You know, they don't look for a while. No worries, Neko. Take it easy. Take it easy. Relax. Relax. So I'm also kind of like turning these exploration cyberpunk stuff into, you know, we talk about whatever the heck we want to. So for those who do play Dead by Daylight, how are we, how are we feeling about that, the new update? Like I said, I'm, I'm feeling honestly perfectly fine with it. I actually really do enjoy it. I do enjoy the new UI. But, you know, I know it's not for everybody. So I'd just like to know. Hello! Come on, he's fine with me. Sick. Oh, boink! Yeah, no, the hitboxes are definitely off, and there's the extended lunges. So, like, you know, that's, that's kind of the only thing that's not super fun for me. But at the same time, like... We can, we can deal with it. I'm sorry. Sorry, what? Oh, fuck! Dude just fucking blew up a... Mm, dude fucking blew up a freaking propane tank next to me. I'm trying to make it where I don't take damage from those. But they fucking suck. Yeah, I think it's just the hitboxes that are the only thing that's bothering me. But once again, it's a bug. It's going to get fixed. And once again, I think the UI will grow on people in due time. It's just people don't like change. People want it to stay the same. And it's like, okay. You know. Nah, you won't be causing any more problems. Oh, we're back here. Enemy contact. I'm engaging. Yeah. Some animations are great. What what animations are weird in your in from what you think? I'm just curious. For short circuit you I will contagion you. Well, once again, like, I think it's fine where we don't have any, like, back pain now. Like, our characters always look like they had just so much back pain. Like, they're hunched over, they're crouching, they're like, man, dude, I fucking have the worst posture in the world. I lost the ability to move forward for a little bit. That was strange. I think I'm going to use the shotgun for a little bit. Yeah. Like, once again, I think it's just going to grow on people as time goes on, but I think I think what people should be honestly uh, complaining about, if they're going to be complaining about anything, is just complain about the hitboxes. Truthfully, that's really all they should be complaining about right now. And that's my just my honest opinion. Um, okay. Where is the most amount of people? There's fucking explosions everywhere. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna just get contagion you. Initiate overload. Initiate overload. And short circuit. Person's down. Overheat. There's just so many explosives, I just don't want to deal with it right now. Tajin. On top of that. Yeah, the, the, the hitboxes are like kind of the only thing that I'm really worried about, honestly. 
Dude, aren't you just gonna contagion him? Alright, I'm just gonna give AIDS to your friend here, and then you're gonna die. Oh god, what happened? It... Hello! Short circuit. Where are these guys? Hold on. These guys are also Valentinos. Protocol. CCMA. Circuit. Yeah. Enough to be upset about it? Maybe. I mean, I play the game a lot, and I'm not. Ups I'm far from upset regarding any of that sort of stuff. Um, I'm just gonna keep, I'm just gonna keep this. There you go. That works. The only downside right now is that that was a fucking giant ass sniper rifle. I'm also interested to see more of the clown stuff. The person we played against did not use any of the clowns new stuff, which sucked. Like, I really, really wanted to see the new clown stuff. I'm gonna be real. But, you know, that is what it is. There's something down here? You're under fire? Hmm. Oh, hello. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Help. I'm trying to move, please. Thank you. Hello. Hold on. Give me one second. Hold on. Give me one second. I'm trying to switch to gorilla arms. You don't deal with the fucking punch master. Put you in the crotch! She deserved that, okay? I just want everyone to know that she deserved that. All you need to know is she has her boyfriend to fist her, and you know, the rest is history. I love the fucking girl arms. They're so good. No! Fuck! <sighs> what? What? Listen, I can say random things. That's my deal. I'll say random things however I want to. Um, also, I think it's going to spawn us back before this. Which blows, which blows. Can't I be random, Palapples? Oh, so, no, okay, got it. Um, I was gonna use it. What did I ask? I don't know. Listen, we got distracted by the fisting. That's all. We just got distracted. Hey, you know, it happens. It happens. You know what I've been watching a lot of lately? I've been watching a lot of like TPM vids, like Disney beat stuff. I really want to go back to uh, Disney World. Not gonna lie. I really, really want to go back to Disney World.
Disney World's the fucking greatest. Are you alive? No, she's dead. Disney World of Ages? Same. I went to Six Flags with uh, Blaze, Blaze last time I went to California, but... Oh no, what did you find? Found death. I think sneaking through this is probably the best way to do it, I'm gonna be honest. Because... I think sneaking is gonna be our best, best bet right now. Protocol, we'll do it. B. Cajun. Dude, it re uploaded to him. That's so unfortunate. Time to fuck shit up. You didn't see me. See? No one saw me. Hey, Serge, how's it going? I mean, once again, I have to, once I'm out of debt, here's the thing. First and foremost, I need to get out of debt. After debt, I need to, like, I'll probably go on a vacation for the first time in a while. Like, I'll go, I'll go on vacation. Then after that, like, I'll, I'll have to find a place to move out. Hey, it's the one who punched in the crotch. Sweet. But, like, I know a few places that I absolutely want to go. Um, which would hopefully be the plan. Like, hopefully I can do what I want. Hello! Are you okay? Alright, whoever this man is with the gun... Fucking... Too strong. There we go. Oof. But yeah, like I know I'm gonna be going to Cali for uh, E3. If E3 comes back, right next year or this year, like I'm going to E3. I have stuff I need to do there. You know. I got. Uh, I got my friend who's also who also streams every now and again, who I really want to raid at some point. But he, him and I never are on at the same time because he streams during the week, the middle of the day, and I don't. <laughs> but, uh, like, I gotta, I need to do all that. And E3, 20, it was E3 2018, so much fun. Madre, what you got? Dude's not saying too much. Gun for hire. Give him his temper rams. He's no time over dark bears. Gotcha. Yeah. I, I'm not a big fan of in and out I'm gonna be real. Is this the guy I'm looking for? Oh, it is. Okay. I need to go to the restroom. Just don't mind me. Just go into the restroom. Just a lady going to the restroom. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Oh, 
juzga la huetuda. Oh, I'm checking out myself in the mirror. Hold on. Didn't want to do that. Oh, shit, dude. I look hot. I got a big booty. Oh, I'm here. Shh. Be very, very quiet. There's somewhere here. I don't think they realize what's going on. Anyone think they realize what's going on yet? Did it without raising the alarm. I did it without raising the alarm. Don't worry, guys. Totally did it without raising the alarm. Totally. We can jack into this. Hmm. Interesting. Man, I did that without raising the alarm once. I feel so proud of myself. Um. I think I want to go. Fifty-five. Let's see. Boom, got it. Oh my gosh, you have dates. Oh my gosh, you're gonna short circuit yourself. Oh my gosh, and you're on fire? Dude, that's so weird. Like, they, that's so weird. I'll carry the body later. That's so weird. That guy just totally, like, contracted AIDS randomly and died. That was, that was the only way that was going to work. Some things in this game, you just don't question. Carrying too much? God dang. There's so much stuff to do, dude. There's so much stuff. I'm going to just take this, just while I'm at it. 
Still need to level up that pistol. Dude, I got a better shotgun. Oh, shit, dude. I'm excited. I have a better shotgun. Gonna fuck shit up. No one can stop me now. I got a pretty good revolver. Dude, what is... Like, that... Whatever shotgun that we just got looks fucking sick. I'm gonna be real. I still need a better sniper rifle, though. But I can't make a sniper rifle right now. So I'm actually... I'm curious to know what we're about to do. I'm gonna get rid of all that stuff. And... Picked up a hazmat suit. Let's get the... Uh, let's figure out if we got some better stuff. We can do. We fucking do. It's like I'm in a really high-level area right now. Which is weird. I think we were supposed to be. I also don't know what dictates high level and low level, low area. So, dude, now we look like a classy businesswoman. I'm I'm excited for this. I'm a classy ass businesswoman. Dude, somebody's just having having a great time right now. Is this a smart shotgun? Did I just pick up a fucking smart shotgun? Is that what just happened? D did my sh shotgun just decide, yes, I have brains, I am great. Welcome to... Hmm. Welcome to Istanbul, I guess, I don't know. All right, let's see. Let's see if this is an actual smart shotgun. Greetings. I have questions. It totally is. This is a smart shotgun. The bullets of the shotgun home in on enemies. This is the greatest thing I've ever seen. I'm so excited by this. You guys have no idea how excited I am. Hello. Why is it drunk? See? Did it without raising the alarm. What up, Padre? What you gonna tell me? I feel like half of his lines are missing. Anyone else getting that feeling? Like, Padre seems like a cool guy, but like half his lines are just gone. Hello! How are you guys doing? Oh, hi. Hold on, everything's okay, everything's okay. Jesus. Oh, dude, I just killed her friend. Whoops. Oh. You guys, wait, why are you guys stuck inside of here? Whatever. Alright, I think she's dead. Cool. Hello. Dude, the fact that we have a shotgun that homes in on people is like the greatest thing. Can we just be real? At the drop point. Oh, dude, it's at a. Oh, I gotta, I gotta run over here real quick. Let's pick up our reward and then we'll go. Food? Do you have food for the poor?
You know what? I'm just gonna beat these guys up. What the fuck happened? What do I do? Every single one of them has a headache now. Do 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 do. Oh shit, dude. Somebody's fucking... What is, what is... What guns are they using that this is happening? There's... What sort of gun... They're using an assault rifle. Personal space? and punching them. I don't know what you're talking about. Hey, yo, personal space! Punching him in the face. Alright then. Alright. Let's go grab this. Meet with Judy, it says funnily. Dude, I like how the game is like, hey, you still need to meet with Judy. Meanwhile, Kit not wanting to meet with Judy. Like, very much does not want to meet with Judy right now. Even though we are going to bang her later. No. I have side missions to do. Judy will have to wait. What if I use this? Do you guys think this is more effective? Oh shit, dude. I whacked the... I like the back woman. Oh god! Rose behoves for a hose mentality? True. But she cute though. Listen, the only chance I have at dating anybody is inside of video games. Sometimes that's just the ch chance we have to take. Shit, she's just rolling on the ground. Aw, uh, poor police officer. Police officer down. Police officer down. Interesting. Um, there we go. Done and done. We got this to do, and we got that. So we're gonna go here first. I know like a lot of these are just kind of out of the way, but it's fine. It's fine. I'm just using a freaking wrench to defeat people, so it's fine. Perfectly okay. It's a kniffy. We got a kniffy. Also, I have 347 healing things. Dude, that guy's dancing with the girl. That guy's got more game than me. So these ads, still creepy. Still creepy to this day. What up, buddy? Gonna keep on going. Gotta keep on going. Let me just connect here real quick. Dude, this game is starting to get more and more glitchy the more this goes on. Like, I, I'm i actually really... I'm starting to get really shocked by how glitchy the game goes. The more things happen. Hold on. Do the, oh, wait, give me this. Give me this one. Dude, that guy just came at me with a fence. Dude, that guy just came at me with a fence. How do you respond to that? Oh, this girl's on fire. 
How do you respond to a guy coming at you with a fence? Like the grab a cactus guy just coming at you, just like, nope, I got a fence for you. It's like, why? What did I ever do to you? I'm gonna fence ya. It's like, okay, dude, really? Why does that girl have three mouths? Can somebody please explain to me why that girl has three mouths? I'm a little terrified. Not gonna lie. Hello? Up and up we go. Hey. Looks like the priestess. Probably not the priestess. It is the priestess. I knew it. I know my tarot cards. Nobody can beat me in tarot card duty. Not even Planet. Plapples, I gotta ask, how did you come up with your name? Like, your name is easily 10 out of 10. All apples. Apples that are pals. Makes sense. Makes sense. Dude, every time my boss turns around, and like, whenever I'm on Discord when like, work is slow, and she turns around, like, you'll usually be in the Discord, like, talking, and she always just like, looks, and she's like, I love Palapples. I'm like, alright. I'll let them know. Every time. Just, it's just a great name. It's just a great name. Very popular. Indeed. Indeed. You're more popular than me. You're fine. You're fine. We can reset this. There we go. See, I was never, uh, never a popular kid. Never was. No entry enters anyway that's right i'm going against the law i entered in the exit area that's right i'm bad picking off my hats headache for days Oh, you don't see shit. Let me put one side popular. Gotcha. Yeah, in high school, like, I was never, like, popular popular. But, like, yeah, people definitely knew of me. And then when I was in student council for a specific amount, like, people then were like, oh, yeah, yeah, we know who he is. He's the one who's, like, knows the shit. I was also really bad at public speaking at that point, and then I stopped becoming bad at public Come speaking. Meanwhile, this person over here... Hi! Oh! 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 That's right. Fucking did it. Give me service. See, so when I had to do the student council, like, when we were for student council having to, like, talk about ourselves and everything, like, I felt like, oh, I got this. I can do this. This is fine. Like, I can, I just have to talk about who I am. I have the script. I gave it to them. Things are great. Things are great. But I would sway from side to side and like I never bothered to memorize anything because like I was still new at it. No one told me anything and it was the dumbest thing. Like I looked so dumb and people still liked me though. There's a side job here. What 
can I get for you? Something hot. Cold. Coffee. Liquor. Give me a Tiancho. Tiancho will do the trick. Everyone listen up. This is a fucking robbery. Mr. Slick, behind the counter? Yeah, you. Shut the fuck up. Put your hands up where I can see them. The rest of you, stay where you are. And don't fucking move a muscle. If I hear so much as a peep, you'll be getting a side order of lead. We clear? Wallets on the table. Keep your mouth shut and... Somebody likes being the center of attention. What part of keeping your fucking mouth shut did you not understand? How about you go first? Hand over your wallet. Nice and easy. I can't believe you've made it this far. You and your shit again? People who don't judge their competition don't last too long on the streets. I've met people like you before. They're all dead now. Know why? Because none of them could get the speck on me. Nice try. You're bluffing. You're trying to trip me I've up. I've danced with Maelstrom and Arasaka. You think you could so much as scratch me? You'll die before you can pull that trigger. I guarantee you. Fuck it. Let's bail. For years, nobody touches this place, and now this? Where's 6th Street when you need them? Thank God you were here. Order whatever you want. It's on the house. I got you, buddy. I'll take a drink. What can I get for you? Something hot. It's on the house. Still has to pay. Dude, I still gotta pay? Really? So sad. Ezekiel saw the wheel. She never wanted us to memorize anything. Gotcha. So I, I did join like speech and debate for a little bit, but to be completely fair, the only reason I joined speech and debate. Oop, what the hell? Hold on. Me, got a job for you. My client had a shitload of beta acid stolen. What's beta acid, you might wonder? Fuck if I know. But it's worth a lot, and our client wants it back. That's where you come in. Iron at the ready. More info attached. Being completely honest, there were three hot girls, all in speech and debate, that I really wanted to impress. That was really it. Excuse me? Welcome to the Dew Drop Inn, where every day begins with a smile. Was supposed to meet someone here. Name's Booker Updike. Okay. Well, is he here? Oh, I don't know. I'm just filling in for my tomb BFF. She's under the knife today. Chill place you got here. Quiet, calm. I'm not the best Think person, so? I'm realizing. Probably owe all that to Sixth Street. Anyone tries to harass our guests, they keep them out good. Oh shit. You ain't with the cops, are you? More the opposite. <gasps> you! Good. I ain't supposed to talk to cops. Gotcha. Anything available short notice? Oh, one Somebody? sec. Uh, mm. that kind of thing. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. Got one on the ground floor. Is that okay? I'll take it. Fifty dollars for a room? Oh, Fuck yeah. Oh, but hold on, I gotta redo this. Do drop in cannot be held liable for damages to personal effects and guest well being. We reserve the right to deny service by force if necessary. Please enjoy your stay. Thanks. Like I never left home. Thank you. Um, don't think you joined anything to date anyone? See here's the thing. I was such a loner in high school that like I thought I, I'm gonna be completely honest I thought the only way to ever like fit in was to like date somebody I liked and show that I could do it unfortunately that's not the case so you know it didn't uh it never went well it never went well. um so with that being said like yeah. Let's see. E9. 
Um, 1C, FF, 1C, sure. So, oops. So I guess when you fuck up, that's where that happens. That guy just had a fucking the worst day. Let's just be real. That man had the worst day. Anywho, um, yeah, like I. I mean, it never worked out for me, right? It never worked out for me. But I, there was always that part of me that was like, maybe I'll be able to. Maybe. Just maybe I'll be able to, like, have a shot at with somebody. Uh, it never happened. And uh, that was all there is to it. from the room upstairs. Wait, wait, is that... Look! Ah, oh, neoamphetamine. You mean to tell me you can pin the exact drug from just a whiff? Like a police dog, or what? I'd say more like a... a sommelier. <laughs> I'm good. Is this Booker? Yeah, dude's dead. Suffocated, looks like. Probably in his sleep. A peaceful death in this town. Guy won the jackpot. Take a look upstairs. Got a feeling our ripper supplies up there. Somewhere close to a vent. True. Poor Booker Updike. Dude died in his sleep. Hey, you work here. Nah, just fucking taking in the sight. Asked you nicely. Should I ask another way? All right, all right. No need getting worked up. Yeah, I work maintenance. Plumber, electrician. Okay. Don't invite you here. Fuck off! Don't let me get in your way. What the fuck is happening to this guy? This. Really don't know how I feel about that. That, uh, that, I don't know what we just witnessed there, but anyway. Uh, what I was going to say though is, like, most of my stuff in, like, in high school was never like, oh, I want to, like, date this person, so I'm going to do this, 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 this. It was pretty much near, like, the last portion of my, uh, high school where I kind of started thinking that because. My high school had this whole thing is like if you never date anybody, you were a loser. Or at least that's what like student council led me to believe. So like I was like, well shit, I don't wanna 
I want to be branded as that. Like, I want to show that, you know, I'm not entirely loser. So I tried to do whatever I could, uh, and it did not work out ever. I think the closest I got was taking somebody to homecoming who, like, didn't want to date, but was fine with, like, kissing and such. That was the closest I ever got. Which I guess worked for people, so I was like, cool. I did it! <laughs> It, uh, you know, is what it is. Oh, dude's watching VR porn. Look at that. We were watching that dude have do some VR porn. Well, okay. Sounds weirdly ahead of its time. What do you mean? I'm sorry, this is a 20 to force open? Downstairs, that's getting fucked up by this. Interesting. Tree of one. See, if you're watching somebody, like, that, I, I don't know how to respond to that. I'm not, not gonna lie. I don't know how to respond to that. find somebody who's just interested in actually having sex. You're gonna watch VR porn. What? Somebody... I don't know. I don't know how to respond to this question. I'm not gonna say anything about that, so... Retreat! It's all good. Retreat? Oh. Hello. Short circuit. That sounds hilarious. No. Sometimes that's just how it is, you know? Sometimes that's just how it be. I love us people who are just extremely lonely and will resort to doing whatever it takes. It's just how it be sometimes. It's fortunate it is for some. That just how it be. The person doesn't have a fucking answer. I wonder what's in that room. Yeah, that, uh, that's a little weird. It's a little, little sketch, not gonna lie. It's super sketch, in my opinion. Jesus. Nerd's gotta get it on, too, I guess, right? Attention, NCPD subcons. Suspected organized crime activity reported on Hargreave Street. APB out for Darius Miles, wanted for murder. Perp belongs to hey, the Darius. street gang and leads one of its drug manufacturing rings. The city has promised a reward for terminating the threat from Miles and his drug cell. Cool. Oops, don't want that. Intelligence, breach protocol, quick hacking. Oh, I've already done that, so... Blank, blank, blank. Uh, 
That's quick hacking for you. Trying to quick hack. Dance is high school. See, I, I went to uh, homecoming, and then when we had to like actually make prom, like making prom, I had to go and never like talked to anybody or did anything. Actually, I do have one prom story. I was gonna talk about this. Oh, when when did we talk about prom? It was uh, we're talking about school dances at was it a Dead by Daylight stream? I think it was a Dead by Daylight stream. Because I wanted to mention the the whole uh, watching two people fuck in a car while driving. It was an interesting thing. So let me let me explain what happened. So we there so there was a student council car, and we all decided to group up together to drive home. That was just kind of the, the general gist. We all just need to group up. That's the entire thing. Go from there. What happened, though, is while we were driving, there was a, uh, you know, it was like 3 in the morning or something at that point because we, you know, we stopped to get food. We hung out with other people in student council, and all of our phones were almost dead, so we're just like, okay, we need to definitely get home, and we're a little bit lost, so it was not the greatest thing, and nobody had, uh, nobody had anything to uh, plug in your phone. So, what ended up happening is we're just driving along and we're like, okay, we're going to take the road and we're going to hope we can find an exit that looks familiar to us. Which eventually we did. But there were so few cars out and about that we were like kind of nervous. Because like, when you're, when you're driving around and there's like hardly any cars, you're like, Fuck, it's like a ghost town. Like, why is there nobody here? At, some, at one point though, you know, we, we find this car just driving alongside us, you know, just driving along, nothing, nothing weird. And we see that there's three people inside. That's, that's really it. There's just three people inside this car. So we're just like, hmm, okay, that's a little, okay. So there's just three people in the car. That's, that's fine. And all of a sudden, like, you know, we're we're just watching and looking at them and they look in our car and they give us like the whole like, yeah, dude, radical, like that sort of thing. So we're just like, OK, you know, this. Uh, you know, they're just they're just doing their thing, you know, they're just driving around and just why not then? The person who was driving was like, I don't remember who, but I think it was a girl who was driving. But there was definitely a guy and another girl in the back. And then after a little bit, like, we kind of speed past them. Like, the person who was driving our car sped up because she didn't want to deal with it. And we're just like, I'm, listen, it's in the morning. Like, what, what possibly could they do? Like, there's nothing, like, they can do to kind of, like, fuck us up or something. So like that that's what we're like we're just like okay well we just gotta you know, we gotta do the whole thing they drive up next to us again we're looking at them we're like okay so they're back what do they want and we all of a sudden realize that the guy doesn't have a shirt on and pretty sure he didn't have his pants on either neither was the girl and you just they're just fucking in the back seat while the other girl is driving and just like looking at us and it was the most like we didn't we didn't know what was going on we were all kind of like you know confused and literally like that's what happened fucking they just started fucking in the back seat while this girl was driving Nothing we could uh, really say or say about it. It was like, oh god, this is what's happening. 
And uh, yeah. That was the gist. What's what's going on with this room up here? I already went to the room up here. Do I have to drop it at the drop point? What is it? This drop point? It is. So this is totally important home somewhere. I don't know if it is or not. It'd kind of be funny if it was, gonna be honest. But yeah, like that was. We were we were a little bit like, what the fuck happened? And like at that point, like, you know, I've never seen at that point in my life, I've never seen somebody naked, like another human being naked, only like online. So like it was definitely like, what the fuck did I just witness? Sort of thing. And uh then because like I was like, you know what, I just want to go home. I just want to sleep this off. And uh, from what I was told. So, V, the beta assets secure? Padrissimo. And well, while, I, while they're doing that, uh, I'm going to go grab this. And I'm putting you down for 10 bonus points for solving the mystery of Booker's fate. It's clean work, V. Contracts closed. Gratitude's on the way. Sweet. Um, apparently... The people had an orgy afterwards so the people i was in the car with that's what i was told but i don't know if it was actually true i missed it so you know that uh yeah missing everything sounds like what do you deem me did i'm sorry hold on like I, I have a lot of questions about what what we're go where we're going with this. Like the D and D campaign itself, like it's, there's just an orgy, or like the players are like, all right, cool, sounds good, wrapping it up. All right, who's taking off their shirt first? That would be a fucking weird ass way to end D and D. Holy shit! That would be incredible. Not gonna lie. I can imagine it's probably the campaign. I just, that was just a funny ass thought that just went through my mind. Things are just be weird, you know? Things be weird. Good old athletics that never raises up fast. Alright, so hopefully we can get this Del main cab. So I'm sending the coordinates of a vehicle that went dark near to where you are now. Thanks, Del main. Thanks. I'll try to find and reset. Yikes, that is a that is a tail and a half. Wow, that is a tail and a half. Jesus. Well, uh now at least you didn't oh fuck. Leap of faith! Can I just zoom in? Dude, this is a, this Delamain's a fucking stunt driver. What is going on here? What is going on here? That's really fucked up, Lapples. Holy crap. Ooh, jeez. That's really fucked up. At least you're safe.
Hello, Delamain car. You see them too, don't you? The curve in their beaks. It hides something. Something insidious. You mean... Flamingos? Flamingos? They are real. Flamingo. Flaming. Oh, the O. It's oxygen. There's no flame without oxygen. Listen, you... Call me Clarice. Okay, Clarice. The flamingos are a problem, I'm sure, but it's time to go home. Delamain's asking for you. Back down Jesus. now as they stand screaming. No, impossible. Leave it to me. I'll Understandable. So, a slaughter. Very well, Judgment Day has come. Swift, severe, deeper. This quest is to legitimately destroy lawn flamingos. This is a Delamain vehicle that is scared of flamingos. I mean, true, yeah. Where the fuck did the Delamain thing go? Gotta still be around here somewhere. Well, Clarice, have the flamingos stopped screaming? Perhaps I ought to return after all. I need support. Only one with chaos within can give birth to a dancing star. Clarice? Shut down. Oof. What a fucking weird ass thing. I just re-established contact with the missing vehicle. Splendid work, V. First class. I shall forward a share of your fee. That was a fucking weird ass. Do these Delamain things are like kind of creepy, not gonna lie. Is this the car? Dude. Shut off that radio station. Cool. All right. We are doing fucking great right now. Also doing really, really well. Got a few other things we got to do. Let's in fucking go. Grabbing all the cars. I'll just take this car, I guess. So. Uh, there's just some, gosh, there's some weird people who just like to do weird things. See, I always, like, whenever I, like, think of, like, regrets and stu stuff, or, like, things that could have happened, uh, <clears throat> this is, for some reason, plays into the part of the OG thing. Like, there was a, uh, a friend group I was a part of that I don't want to go too far into, but essentially... Because I thought there were people who respected, like, clean, like, innocence. Like, I just kind of acted like I was clean, innocent, didn't know what sex was, anything of that sort. Just to, uh, kind of fit in with the group. Turns out they're definitely the opposite, but since I was the clean, innocent friend, they are like, Oh, we definitely want to have you along. So that kind of sucked. But, like, turns out they would, like, they'd plan to watch, like, really sexually explicit stuff and, like, do that sort of thing. But they're like, oh, we gotta keep keep Kid out of it, because he's, you know, innocent and such. If we don't want to let him know. And I was like, what? sorry, what? And, uh... Yeah. That, uh, missed out on all that, because... They thought I was innocent. They're like, we don't want to have you around when that's happening. But every time else? Sure. Yeah. Well, it was funny because they were trying to talk, like, gosh, what was one of the conversations they had with me that, like, I was trying so hard not to laugh, but it's just, it was funny because, like, they were, 
convinced that I was innocent. Fucking, um... Oh, they're trying to teach me what double penetration was? And, like, I just kept acting like I was, like, not understanding. <laughs> and they're just like, oh, man, he's such a sweet and innocent cinnamon roll. You guys have been in my streams for a little bit. You guys know. Definitely not an innocent cinnamon roll. By any means. Pretty, it was kind of funny, I'm not gonna lie. It was definitely pretty funny. Pretty humorous, not gonna lie. I think one of them like caught on to the fact that I was lying, but like it wasn't until like months later. So Oh, video finished rendering. Sweet. So after this, uh, after this real quick, I'm going to go, so after we do this mission, I'm going to real quick step off to the side and, uh, do whatever the fuck it's called. You're going to start rendering another video. Cause I'm trying to get all of them put up. It's been a bit, been a bit. So I got to record some Genshin stuff. It's just. Crazy, crazy busy here. Crazy, crazy busy. I'm also thinking about some other games to, to like stream. After we get done with, with these, like that's just kind of been. I'm not gonna lie. Everything that's been on my mind lately, lately, I'm gonna be real, is just stream related. It is literally just streaming, hey, streaming, streaming, streaming. Got a serious gig, which means I'll be needing a serious mark. I want you to hop to 6th Street Turf, graft a virus onto their tech. Counting on you, champ. Oh, and one last thing. There's this techie, Lucius Thorin. I wouldn't mind if he got a piece of lead to the skull. You dig? Good. Specs attached. <laughs> These guys just chill, I guess. Yeah. Lately, like, yeah, all of everyone like do and like talk about is streaming right now, which is why I feel really, really like shitty that I keep sleeping, oversleeping. Oh my gosh, that is two Cleopatras about to suck that guy's dick. I thought that guy was just about to ask what's the last time he fucked anything. I was like, um, dude, that's strangely fitting in with this conversation, but like. These are quick hacks, so. There you go. See, I just, I feel like I waste a day when I sleep, which is why when I slept yesterday, felt like I wasted a day. And then slept today, felt like I wasted today. You know, I, have, I have games I gotta play, I got stuff I gotta do, you know? Still human, but you know, I still got stuff I wanted to do. Rebel, 
What is down here? Where am I? This Lucius. What? Trying to play gorilla now? Hello? There we go. They should all be down. Sweet. It works. Yeah. I know I'm human. I just there's you know there's stuff I want to get done. You know, stuff I want to do. I just don't like not doing anything. And the moment I'm, I realize I'm not doing anything, I'm like, damn. Need to need to switch this up. The six trees. Which one of these guys was Lucius? Are you Lucius? You are. Alright, cool. I was like, he's incapacitated right now, but I can end that. And I did. Oh, that just happened. But I'm only human. And I bleed when I pop down. Words of my heart, sound of my heart. Oh, okay. You okay? Alright, well, she's dead. Just one punch to the face. It's all over. Dude, 12 out of 13? 12 out of 13? No! How close am I to leveling up? No! Dude, no! I was one away! I was one away! By the way, like, there looks to be something going on in here. This guy's watching VR porn. Again. Always something, dude. Somebody's always watching the VR prawn. Why me? Conventions of a brain dance addict. Why do I want to have sex in my brain? But yeah, no, that's the thing. So the VR porn in this game, the way it works, because they actually talk about this, is that you wire your brain into the VR headset, and while like your body is like not doing anything, your brain is getting stimulated, um, and all. And yeah, they do call it a mind fuck, but like a literal sense. Profesh as ever be. Sixers will think twice before sliding their gunk asses anywhere near my turf again. And that thing with Lucius Thoran? <laughs> Cherry on top. Contract closed. There we go. And the hacker. 
Um, okay, so we so far doing good. Is that everything? Rancho Coronado. It's like we're missing something in Rancho Coronado, right? I think. Maybe. Arroyo. Pretty much good with. Next will be over here. So we're just going to do that. The jungle. Is that complete all of them in Santo Domingo? Which is, uh, seems messy. Yeah. Okay, so Santo Domingo is just that. All right, cool, 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 cool. And I think we've already done Pacifica. So next is Westbrook. Give me just one moment. I want to get something uploaded here. God, dude, look. Shit. Mm. Look. Look, dude. Um, let's see. What is this? So is that. This is oh, okay. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Right, need to do this. This did that. There was a stream we did that was seven and a half or almost eight hours, which is crazy. Crazy, crazy, crazy. That's what he did the final year of my time at Porsche. So I have to now split these two real quick. I'm gonna be in good shape. I think we're we're pretty good. I'm just waiting for it to have to wait for it to finish something and then I can render it. Oh dude, my legs still feel like shit. My legs still feel like shit. Holy fuck, dude. Ooh. Alright. Um, I guess we're just gonna keep running places. Cause dude, athletics in this game sucks. It really, really sucks. But we'll just keep running. Just endlessly running. Oh, wait. Did I get... No. How close is quick hacking to being leveled up, by the way? 91. Okay, cool. So it's close. And then we don't really have to worry about that. And we'll just have to worry about uh, punching and killing people in those different ways. I gotta worry about crafting though. Crafting and the intelligence ones. I think that's all I really need to worry about. Maybe. I'm sorry. Who sees me? They do. Okay, cool. Levels, I gotta say, you stay up really late too. Which I appreciate. I'm glad that I'm not the only one who stays up like super super late. I know Neko does too, but I, I know Neko's been exhausted lately, so. Just running, running. You're not a loser. Hell no. You are not a loser. Don't don't you dare call yourself a loser. 100% not. I can confirm. I 
I know Poop Center probably also confirmed too. Definitely not. So I can talk to him. I gotcha. I gotcha. I I understand that though. I'm I'm pretty much the same way. So no problem. See, I really like streaming like really really late at night. Just cause like it's more calm, it's more relaxed. I just I know a lot of people are like they always want to watch like during the actual day and such. And it's like man, I wish I could stream during like the middle of the day. Like I I have it all planned out in my head. If I if such when I'm able to do this full time, like literally, I would stream. Like during the middle of the day would be the games that people would really really want to see, and then at night would be like either grinding or games that people are like just like meh maybe not like more to like design divisive games right like i do the story player story and like single player stuff probably like midday and then maybe some of the multiplayer stuff later you know like i have it all playing out in my brain That guy died very, very quickly. No, I didn't do anything wrong. What are you talking about? What are you talking about? Fire. Down again. Oh no, I planned so far for the future. It's crazy. Too bad things. See, here's the thing: you don't have to be bad. You, you, you don't have to be good at games in order to uh, to stream. That's what everyone thinks, right? But let's be real: there are thousands, tens of thousands of streamers who are really bad at games. Who? Are you okay, sir? I think this man's a uh, frozen stiff. Like, really? As long as you're fine talking to people. Right? As long as you're fine talking to people, having a conversation, and just enjoying the game at, at the same time, that's all that really matters. Just quick up. Pull down by then. Sweet. Alright, cool. Like, that's really all it comes down to is just, hey, uh, like I, oh shit, dude, oh, we're gonna die. Nope, we're good. Cool. You don't need to be good at games, you don't need to be like, even be like super knowledgeable in them. If you want to stream games, just play a game that you enjoy, that you have fun with, and then just talk about what's ever on your mind. I always recommend to people, you know, grabbing a note card, grabbing a piece of paper, and write down everything. Hi, Jezebel. How are you doing? Or Jess. I don't know why I say your full name, but Jess. Uh, I'm off tomorrow, actually. So, I can, uh, I can keep streaming for a while. How are you doing, Jess? Feels like it's been a while. Got you, I got you. But yeah, I have work off tomorrow. So, I can stream that sort of stuff. Also, yeah, as I was saying, though, you don't have to be good at games to stream. Like, let's be real, there's a lot of people who make probably a living off of being really bad at video games. Or, worse, claiming they're really good at video games and then just lying to a bunch of people. I can't tell you how, like, much I hate, like, the videos out there of people being like, hey, this is how you play this game. The big one's Among Us. It's like, hey, this is how you get really, really good at Among Us. It's like, like we're just essentially giving everyone information on what to not do. Fire. Um. Here with Mark, Mark is a little bit different. Mark is really good at horror games, but bad at majority of other games. That's that's his his gist. But like once again, it's his commentary and his personality that really like take off and just make him so much so much fun to watch. 
But if he's playing a horror game, dude's fucking phenomenal. 10 out of 10, phenomenal. When you, uh, right, like, when you see him play a horror game, dude's great. But then you watch him play any other game and you're just like, eh, really? Just those things that have to them at this point. True. So yeah, it doesn't, it doesn't really fade. Um, I, I never thought that Mark was that bad as a person. I know there was like, he had issues. He, from what I understand, because I've been watching Mark for a for quite some time. Uh, I watched him since he was part of Polaris's uh, Rayman tournament when it was him and Bonsai, I think it was together. He was, I think it was Bonsai. I don't remember who the other person was. Um, what am I carrying that is so heavy right now? I seem to be carrying something that is incredibly heavy, and I don't know what. What is my backpack looking like here? I mean, there's cyberware mods, but hold on. Is it grenades? Oh shit, yeah it is, because I have 100. Ooh, okay, hold on. I'm going to switch some stuff out. Whatever, I kind of waste some grenades. Did he? See, I don't. I don't watch too many people on uh, on the the Twitch to know that. So, hmm. yeah, I haven't heard of that. Just one more there. I know his personality has changed over time, and that's kind of with a lot of people's personalities. I know with him, uh, gotcha. Yeah, people, I guess, you know, they change over time, which sucks, but you know. Are you in? Are, wait, who are you? You're better than that. Last warning! Alright. That's weird. I don't know, it it it's all touchy subjects, you know. Those things, yeah. Well I know he started off like really, really nice and everything. But over time, like, I know he was, he's not good with working with groups of people. And, like, he only is close with pretty much his group. So it's, like, Jack, Bob, Wade, and Ethan. But, like, everybody else is, like, a big no-go. So. That's just kind of how it is. There's some people that, unfortunately, um... That's not good. It's just I. Some people like I. I'm not. I don't want to like diss Mark or anything because once again, I don't know if something if something changed or whatever could be the case. In, in my opinion, it's just you know it could be that over time he just decided that uh, that was the thing. Like he just over time thought that that's what the personality had to be. Oh, you're good. You're good. I just, you know, I don't want to tread ground that's like, man, maybe I should Did we say something about it. Do we not? For me, it's just like, you know, Tony says. Yeah, no, he, he said that he's, he's very, very controlling. I just, I don't like... There's only very few people I'll ever, like, talk bad about when it comes to, like, YouTube and Twitch and such, right? Like, for me, I like to remain optimistic. Right? For, for like, Mark, and for, like... Because I'm not also somebody who watches a bit, like, big content creators, right? The only big ones I've ever watched were, like, right, recently has been Maximilian Dude. 
who, from what I've always heard from people, he's the same as he was like 10 years ago as he is now. Hilarious, funny, and just like super, super nice. And straightforward about things. Game just crashed. Cool. Oh, uh, excuse me. That sun bar's stuck in there. Yeah. It's just, there's some people that, like, you you try your best to hope for, like, their positives and everything. Which is why I try to be, like, a very positive person and, like, very optimistic. Um, but, you know. Everyone's got their dark sides. I've heard of the first one. I've not heard of the second. Yeah, lately, I usually bounce around between who I watch. I watch a lot of Maximilian, dude. I still watch a shit ton of Tom Fox, because, like, dude's one of my, like, idols. Dude's hilarious, plays a bunch of just different games, and, you know, has a bunch of fun doing it. It's a dream. Um, and then I'll, like, dance into, like, some other categories. But I don't usually watch, you know, who really want to play indie horror. Yeah. Okay, crew. Gotcha, gotcha. It's just every every content creator leaves their leaves their mark on the space, right? Every content creator really does. And you know, please slow down on YouTube. I usually watch YouTube while I'm like at work or anything. That's really it. Oh, this is unfortunate. So, the only thing I missed was, okay, so it, it sent me back to, it sent me back to, that's fine, that's fine. Let me head on over here, it's over here. Yeah, I'll, I'll usually watch just stuff at work. Um, it's just... And, and for me, I do try really hard to watch, like, my friend's streams. On YouTube, I was really bad at it. And I've been a little bit better at Twitch, but I'm also just... I lurk a lot. I'm not I'm not somebody who really enjoys talking in chat, so yeah. Gotcha, gotcha. Yeah, with me... Gosh, it's just... So much stuff. Alright, I just want to be sure. Right. Ooh, cool, cool, cool. So we're going to hit the next level. Go from there. Trying to figure out the best way to say it. I think the reason why, like, I also just don't talk in chats or anything, I also kind of keep my mouth shut, is because of just all the stuff I've learned over on YouTube. You know, I've been I've been streaming and doing content creation for three years, right? And unfortunately, like, had to re pretty much re hit the reset button on all my content creation stuff since YouTube because of everything that happened. Like, honestly, to a little update to that situation, I'm not even sure who I'm friends with anymore in those communities over there. Like, I'm really not sure. And it, uh... It's weird, because it's like, I'm just in my own little space, right? That's pretty much where I am. It's like, I'm just here, I'm playing games, I've met some awesome new people. At the same time, like, the content creator friends I used to collab with and play games with. I think the only one who I'm still, like, talk to quite a lot, and you guys have seen every now and again in chat, is Yoshi. Uh, Yoshi Monster. Also, I have to now go back through and re-disassemble all this stuff. Oh, whatever. It's fine. Oops. Yeah, Yoshi Monster, I think, is the only one, like, from those days that I'm still talked to and still, like, like, him and I do want to play games together at some point. But everybody else, like, I'm I'm so lost as to where I stand. You know, there's some names I'm probably going to say that no one here might know of. But, like, there's, uh, some people have been playing Genshin recently, like Vic Vion and Vientastic, who, you know, they... They're like, oh man, I've been playing these games. And they're like, oh, I want to stream other with uh, people who play Genshin and such. And I'm over here like, 
I'm rank 55, I have probably more level 90s than most people, you know, I know way too much about this game, like, hey, why not? But it's like I always get turned down, or flip side is I just get ignored, which, you know, is, is what it is. And then, you know, I'm the shits with a bunch of people because of my constant irritation with just one person. But other than that, like, I try my best to, to stay level-headed and stay optimistic. It's just, there's one, it just seems for me, like, there's, I don't know if anyone's, like, ever experienced this, where there's one person that you just, you can't stand. You just, you're irritated by them no matter what. Like, it's just constant irritation. And for some reason, that alienates you from, like, a majority of people. And, like, I've had this happen in high school, and then I am pretty much happening it again with content creation. It's so weird. It's so weird to me. So that's done. Oh, dude, I missed that. Dang. But, yeah. Well, just with with me, like I don't ever like arguing with people. I don't ever like bickering. It just sucks when it's it sucks when you see stuff happen and you're just like, well, fuck it, like it just rubs me the wrong way. But also, like, I have issues with UVs too. And there's those are things that I'm, like I've never been silent on. Like I will speak out when I have issues on communities. Oh, this guy's stuck in a trunk. That's unfortunate. That's uh very, very unfortunate. I'm sorry, what the fuck leveled up? Something leveled up and I don't know what. Hmm. Uh I'm gonna also <clears throat> start leveling this stuff. I'm gonna level up like melee and annihilation. That just seems like a fun thing to do. There we go. Like I don't know if it, like if anyone here has like any communities that come to mind. For me, I'm gonna be real. I'm not a big fan of the Pokemon community. <clears throat> I'm, and that's it's so strange to me because. I love Pokemon. I haven't been super big on the most recent games, and it's purely because of the Pokemon community. I just... I think it's also it's just mainly because I don't see eye to eye with them on a whole lot of subjects and such. And uh, as a result, you know, you get like, pushed out, pushed to the side about things. So it's like, oh, well, that is what it is. But then you have like a really nice community, which is like Splatoon community, which they're super nice and super chill. Let's go this way. Breach protocol. Ooh. But like, why? Dead by Day, like community, at least is hit or miss. Like, let's be real. To lose this point, he'll reinforce me. See, it's not even that. I just get pissed off about fucking shiny Pokemon. That's it. Like, real talk. My a huge pet peeve of mine is people talk about fucking shiny Pokemon. Like, I hate it so much. Because, like, shiny Pokemon used to mean something. Gonna be real. I'm gonna be one of those people. Shiny Pokemon used to mean something. You know, you put spending the man hours trying to grind to get the specific shiny that you want. And now it's just like, hey, by the way, it's just uh, handed to you now. Yeah, it's, it's just handed to you. Like, what, like, oh, you 4,000 odds? Oh, fuck that. Here's a uh, 300. And that's the case now because of the fucking new uh, DLC, right? It's just...
it's just like ugh. that's the thing like i don't care about like the moves and like the meta and all that sort of stuff people can do whatever the fuck they want to do but when i'm told that i'm stupid for not liking shiny pokemon like it fucking rubs me the wrong way which is why i speak out very very against people doing those shiny hunting streams because it's just Ah. But yeah, then like like I said, you have like some people in the Dead by Daylight community who is like absolute gems of a, pe of a human being. They're awesome. They're fantastic, and like the people you want to look up to, right? I've been hearing the the one name a bunch. I think Palapples. You know who they are? At Starva, right? I think that's the person's name. Like I've been hearing you know so much positive stuff about them, and you know. How much of a good part of the Dead by Daylight community they are. That's fucking awesome. And then you hear like... It's like Atsdarva. Somebody uses otter emotes is what it is. It's a guy who uses otter emotes. I don't... I don't think I do actually. Oh. I, I might be confusing you with somebody else who uses like otter emotes. But yeah, it's like... People have been saying like that they're super kind and like super understanding about things. I'm like, oh, that's pretty cool. But then you have other like content creators who, I mean, we've we've seen the side of Twitch like people that will play against who are toxic beyond all hell, and it just makes me sad because it's just like, what are you doing? Does anyone want to talk about this? Does anyone want to talk about this? Does anyone want to talk about this? Sorry for the flashing lights. How did I randomly find this? Can I just ask that question? How the fuck did I just randomly find this? How the hell out of everything did I just randomly find another building that I can just phase right through? Relic malfunction detected. What's going on? Why why was I having that? Does that happen when I'm like... Does that... Why did that just happen? Does that happen when I'm standing still? I want to see if I can get that trigger to trigger again, the relic malfunction. Also, don't mind me, I'm just standing inside of a building. You know. Just completely normal. Nothing wrong here. I'm just surprised I found this. I'm honestly really, really surprised. And super easy to find, too. It's super easy to find. I'm 
so confused how I got that relic malfunction. I'm so confused. Alright, well, let's go. So just so we all know, that it's this building. This is the building that you can just walk through its walls. Yep, I'm here. Alright, cool. Nice. Uh, that's another one for the uh, for the record books. Ooh. Hi, you there, mysterious stranger. You who? Yeah, you. There any other mysterious stranger around here? You know what? How about I tell you a joke? Sure, be my guest. What must all trauma team medics swear to uphold? The hypocritical oath. Okay, what's going on? Hey there, stranger. I'm Brendan, your friendly neighborhood SCSM, and the nicest AI in all of Night City. You can select from a wide range of beverages, or just drop by for a chat anytime. Now it's your turn. What's your name? Why am I talking to Skism? Uh, my name's V. Pleasure to meet you, V. Do you come here often? Uh, pretty often, as a matter of fact. I'm sorry, did I correctly hear you ask if I wanted to join you for a cup of coffee? Um, no. Oh, well, that's okay, because you can have one now. And just to clarify, we don't have to move an inch. How do you take it? Milk? Sugar? Okay, you've got me. I'm sold. Sold? Nothing's gonna be sold here, because you know what? I'm gonna give you a can of Night Cola for free. Thanks. Brendan, right? <laughs> That's right! Gosh, it's so cool you remembered. Even for a simple SCSM. Do you know any jokes? Who's always limbo champion at mercenary cookouts? The Solo! Cool. So did you want something from me? Oh, yes. Well, I do apologize for taking advantage of you at this early stage in our friendship. But could I ask you for a favor? What happened? See that container in front of me? It's completely blocking my view of the street, depriving an SCSM of its greatest pastime. Could you move it a bit to the side? I'll reward you with my undying gratitude, even though... Technically, I don't stock that. See what I can do. Thank you, V. Boy, are you strong. Here, have a refreshing beverage. On me. This whole nice act of yours is just way too much. That's just how I was programmed. You think anybody'd interact with a grumpy, spontaneous, craving satisfaction machine? Exactly. Would you even be able to offend me? Ooh, come on, Sam a whore. Why would I want to do that? You just saved me. All right, can't force you. It's your choice, after all, isn't it? If you call triggering an obscenity conversion subroutine a choice, then you're absolutely right. So they programmed you with irony, too. Or are you just being naive? That depends on you. What would you prefer me to be? You know what? Never mind. Catch you later, Brendan. Catch me? Why? <gasps> Will I be falling? It's just something you say as a way of goodbye. Oh, I get it. I mean, I don't, because catching has nothing to do with goodbyes, but... <laughs> oh well. Don't humans say the darndest things? Catch you later, V. <laughs> what a neat phrase. Gotta keep this place in mind. Uh, keep keep this place in mind. I don't remember who voices that machine. But there's something else we can do later. I just don't remember what. If 
But I remember watching, it was actually a BuzzFeed video, where they were talking about, like, people who... Question, is Jess here? Just a question. Got something that I oh, that's Wanda. That's that's Okanda. Okay, gotcha. I just realized where I was. I just realized where I was. That's not what I wanted. All right, hold on. We're going to save. And we're going to exit to the main menu. Make sure of something. Nah, I'm not going to do it. I'm not going to do it. It'd be funny, but I'm not going to do it. I don't think Jess is here anymore. So we could do it, but I don't think we're going to. But it would be funny, but we're not going to do it. But it would be pretty funny, but we're not going to do it. Welcome to the show. A hello, Vicky. Thanks for having me. I'm sorry, I'm getting people's hopes up. We've done it once before. We don't need to do it again. The last time we did do it with the girl. Nah, no, we're done. We're done. It is 4.42 in the morning, by the way. Holy crap. 4.42 in the morning. Wait, what? I don't know what you just said other than Jesus Christ. I think you mean wait. Probably mean wait. I'm guessing you did not realize what time it is. Correct. Busy slime ranching. Gotcha. I don't need to worry about the fixer there. Slime Ranch, it seems fun. It seems fun, 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 fun. Fun. Fun, 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 fun. fun. Jeez. People be fighting, dude. Do, 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 do. Rescue the person located here. I mean, I probably should take like a brief nap before I go, uh, cause I still gotta go like, I wanted to go at like seven just to get it done out of the way, but I'll be able to do it later. New contact added. Child, I have a grave task for you. The literal kind. The net runner is still alive, but what happens to her is either a matter of time or your discretion. Bugbear is trapped in the net. If she jacks out, the tiger claws stand ready, waiting like vultures to tear her to shreds. And if she doesn't, her synapses will fry soon enough anyway. I am counting on you, V. See the details attached.
So pretty much she's about to die. So those are tiger claws. We need to get them killed. What is going on here? Alright, whatever. Um... I'm gonna use the shotgun. Hi. The shotgun seems like the greatest idea. Is this slime ranching? I don't know. Jess, you missed it! We almost had sex with somebody. We almost had sex with the prostitute. Thought that would be important. Find a way to safely disconnect. Hello. You okay? You whore! Dude, I just got called a whore. I know it. Oh, dude, I just touched your boob. Oops, sorry, hold on. I got you, girl, I got you. So I impaled coolant on her boob earlier, but that's okay. Do ba do do do. Gotta keep on walking, walking, walking. I need to just stuff her in the back. Okay. Well, that just happened. Guess we just shoved her in the back of a car. Why not? We can't do that because that means we get to do things. As they say, we will be in touch. Contract closed. Okay. Good stuff. Yeah, if I go, if I talk to Takamura, then it's it's over. Like we're like we then we start story stuff, and I'm trying to avoid story stuff as much as possible. When you are sky eye, make sure you eat moon cheese. Moon cheese for days. Wait, sorry. I just. Why did you say your Friday nights? What's going on? I zoned out. What is what is happening? Dude, this bike is in the ground. It's not.
It's like, oh, there's something over here. Over. Aw. I'm pretty sure you're not a whore, okay? I'm pretty confident about this. Hello, team! How do you guys feel about shotgun? Man, dude, all of these guys just got stuck in places. They really... They, uh... There you go. Lost and found. It's gonna be really bad, though, if, uh... We'll see what happens. There you go. I was like, what the fuck am I gonna do? Yeah, people are gonna be starting to wake up in this house here relatively soon. So I gotta make sure that we be good. So I'm gonna probably keep going until like 5.30 or so. Then we'll stop the stream and then I'm going to hopefully wake up early enough to uh, go get oil changed and then we'll do Genshin when I get back. V, you are to rescue Lauren Costigan, wife of Bradley Costigan, my client. She is being held captive by the Tiger Claws. If you wish to know more, read the attachment. Okay. There we go. Why bra? Why am I being told bra? I haven't done anything wrong, as far as I'm aware. Go. This guy is stapled to the wall. One second, please sleep. I slept. I took a nap earlier. It'll be fine. You'll be fine, you'll be fine. Dude, I found a shower. Oh, fuck no. I found a shower. I can wash my hair now. Adrenaline takes to uh, die. Access granted. Let's go. Down we are. Hi. Goodbye. Hmm, that doesn't seem good. There's somebody over here. That guy was so confident. He's like, finally, somebody I can. Then he died. I I got Lathletics to level 6. Let's go. Connect. Connect. Connecting. Got it. Fucking got it. We have no one. 
ba -da -ba -da -ba -ba. Let's see. Hi. You want something? I'm getting you out of here. What? Your husband hired me. I'll make sure you're safe. Stupid fucking worthless piece of shit. There, there. You've got to help me. I'm begging you. That's why I'm here. Come on now. Let's get up. Head down. What is this girl doing? I don't know what this girl be doing, but... Area is still hostile for some reason. Dude, that guy's body just bounced. All over now. Better Delta. Hello? You want to talk to me? You want to talk to me? Is there someone who can help you? Um, my mom? Tell her to lay low somewhere. They'll be looking for your family, friends. You understand? Y yeah. Oh, wh what about Brad? Just focus on yourself right now. Hey, see that car? It'll take you someplace safe. Thank you. Look out for yourself. Gotcha. We got gotcha, you, buddy. Still can't go there. Do this. And there. It's, dude. Oh, fuck, dude. There's like this area right here is like fucking terrifying because I don't want to start anything. You know? I don't want to start anything. So let's. Snoring is secure. I'm informing Bradley now. Thank you for your help. Contact closed. We will. One of these days, like, you know, we might do like a. If, if this game gets like all fixed and everything and gets to a point where like. It's super fucking good. Like, we might come back to this game and also, like, just read everything. I'm not opposed to doing that. But, never know. Also, this double jump, if I didn't have this double jump in this game, it would be crazy. Hello. I shot you in the dick. Excuse me. Hello. Dude, in the dead. dude, that was a fucking muscular lady. That woman had muscles upon muscles, I swear. Got it. Okay, so now I need to go like around, but there's still the Delamine right there. So armored stuff. Victor Fear Reward from the Ripper Dock Shop. So here's the thing, right? We have stuff north side, and we have some stuff. Dude. It's like it, there might still be stuff around here. Like in Westbrook, there might still be shit. I don't fucking know. Fuck, dude. All right. Let's get, uh, let's go find this Delamain cab. Uh, it's fucking far ass away. It's called Jack Spike. Dude, fucking, if I had a. Oh, that's a bike. That's fine. Let's go. Hey, what up, Carl? There's an I like a cyberpunk. It's fun. It's fun. I still haven't done really any of the story, but, uh,. 
you know, going around just randomly shooting things. It's pretty good. Haven't, uh, haven't blown up much lately. But yeah, I'm trying to do all, all the side stuff first before I do much else. But... A vehicle of mine went dark near your position. Fine, keep an eye out. For unknown reasons, the coordinates came through corrupted, so I'm unable to determine the precise location. Yeah, I, uh, I agree. Hello. That was easy. Stop where you are. Easy. Easy. Here to help. Not one step closer. This is depresso delamine, apparently. Hey. Slow down. Leave me be. This is depresso delamine, apparently. Yeah, like it's it it's shit on upon the media because of glitches and everything, but I don't really mind the glitches. Though I mean we did just jump through a building and phased all the way through under the great into the world, but still. Yeah, understandable. Understandable. I'm just gonna hundred percent in just a one run and then yeah, once it gets hella patched, I, I wanna play through it again and see more of what's going on. Where are you going, buddy? Yeah, back here. Tender release. True, but with the source code, kind of, because after that uh, ransomware sort of thing. I don't know how much we're going to see of it, you know? Dude, this Delamain. Yeah, they, uh, with, when did that happen? Like two days ago or something? And they released a statement saying that they're not going to give in the demands, but they have like the source code for the game and so much other stuff. No one's personal data got out, thank god, but people, some people were like super happy that it happened to CD Projekt Red, and it's like, I don't think the developers intended to release the game yet. Corporate probably did. Well, there you have it. They just blew up a house. Grateful B. I've managed to re-establish contact with the vehicle. Shock therapy works wonders sometimes. I'm sending a tow truck and a share of your fee. Yet only one of those is going to your credit account. Ha ha ha. Thanks, Domain. First game of Zerk, yeah. You'd think, right? You'd think, but people uh, you know. Will do what they do. How much can be done about it? So, yeah. Well, they've they try to put all their resources, you know, into. Uh... Oops. Yeah. They just they tried their best. It was definitely an ambitious project, and uh, like the base of it. Like, here's the thing: the framework of this game is great. I love the framework for this game. But everything else that they were trying to do, like, you know, it does fall flat. But, you know. Hey, what happens, happens. That's right. Anything else? Like, I think they were supposed to implement, like, some more stuff regarding day-night cycle things. There's supposed to be more regarding, like, this, the Ripper Dock stuff. Like, it, it all, it kind of falls flat because, like, it's not that useful or important to the story like really me having double jump is like the only like cybernetic thing and the cyberware stuff that actually helps everything else is just like meh it's okay but the gun the guns feel great the fact that like the the the, the idea that headshots don't always kill is kind of great i like it Obviously. Well, here's hoping, but after we got to see what what the result is of that uh, ransomware attack. See, I think this is my first CD, CD Project Red game, though. That's the thing, because I never played Witcher. I own all three of them. 
I just have never played it. Never had a chance. One day we shall, though. One day. stuff. Oh man, hopefully I can get a second art. That was fantastic. Nice. Always good to have a good of a nice story and uh like good world building. See I don't know really much about the story though for this game just because I've been intentionally ignoring it to do all the side stuff. I'm trying to find the freaking second heart here. Because it'd be nice to find it. my ride they fucked my that the fucking truck spawned in on top of my bike I'm upset by this I'm so upset damn dude that was my bike that was my bike and now it's ruined but yeah I am looking forward to see what they do end up adding I'll probably be finished with the game by the time that happens. So. Um. Let's see what you got here for me. You got anything good? It's extended berserk. Crafting spec. Bleed thermal damage. Uh, sure. I'll grab that. So junk. Yes, please. Yep, it definitely is. Super depresso. Alright, so this guy... Uh, hold on. How am I supposed to collect this? How's Biz treating you, Cassius? Lately? Can't complain. MaxTac raided a black clinic not long past. Since then, custom accounts gone up and so my prices. Coincidence? <laughs> you decide. What do you what do you have, dude? I was supposed to get for free. What's the what's the free reward? Hold on. I, is there supposed to be this what the hell hold on how the hell god it's so bright oh let me let me figure this out some of this stuff is still a little glitchy so oh free re there's a free reward bug let me see Oh, come on. Let's see. Oh. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. So, hold on. It's... I have to go to hand... Nope. Hands... This... That's what it is. Cool. Pretty simple. Pretty simple. But yeah, it, they're not a big one, but you know. Rubble Tell. Thank you for the follow, Rubble Tell. 
Touche, welcome to the kit party. Um, arrow card right there. I think I'm almost done with everything, right? There's a few side jobs, and then there's this area. Is that it? That is. Oh my gosh. That's really it. If I get to that point. Ooh, dude, I'm excited. Right, let's go get the tarot card real quick then. Whew. Gonna keep on running, 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 running. See, the other thing that I also don't like right now about this game, though, is also leveling up freaking athletics, which takes forever and a year to upgrade. It's it takes so long, like it kind of it kind of encourages you to not drive and just run around to level it up, which makes me so sad because it's just it's annoying to deal with so annoying. But we'll get there, hopefully. Uh, and we're also pretty good with... With some of this stuff. Jump, jump. And I also hope that they freaking boost the level cap, because I don't like being just level 50. Or the idea that you only get to be level 50 and not level up all your skills. Makes it feel wasted, you know? But that might just be me. So, we'll see. We'll see. Um. Oh my gosh, it's five, almost five fifteen in the morning. So yeah, after we do this tarot card, I'm gonna probably end off the stream. Do that so you can just go to build room and have everything true. But like, I like having everything. That's the thing. Make sure to sleep. Yeah, now I need to go to sleep here in a bit. So, just scan this. Holy Tower. Nope, it's the Emperor. Cool. Yeah, we'll be streaming more tomorrow, as usual. Uh, yeah, you yeah, have a good night as well, Carl. Take it easy, take it easy. Or good morning, at least. Um, okay. So where, what else do I need to do over here? There's thievery. There's a gun for hire. I can't go over there yet. Um... There's this side job, which I think is the Gary thing. Go to Afterlife, which we don't want to do just yet. So I think our next plan of attack, I think is just doing this area, which is what? City Center and Haywood. I think we just need to do City Center and Haywood, and then after that we'll be done. Actually, you know what? Here's where I think we're gonna do. Let's go to the chapel, find this Delamain cab, is there another Delamain cab that I'm missing? It's not here? No. So we'll do this Delamain cab, then we'll end it off. And yeah. And then, all we have to do is those next two places, and then I'll just kind of quickly do a once over. Uh, Cause I want to do a once over of just like, making sure that I have every achievement that I can up at this point, and then we'll start doing the main story. Which I think we want to stop. Start with uh, we'll probably start with Judy, maybe, and maybe not Takamura. I'm not sure. I'm gonna talk to Doge about that. So, um, there you go, the chapel. All right, and then let me set my timer because I'm gonna set it for. We'll do eight thirty. Um, PM. Oops, that's not right. Oop, hi, Delman. High alert now. I lost contact with a vehicle somewhere in your area. Thanks. Eyes peeled. All right. It is. So this one's driving. Jesus. Ow. This one seems to be driving. Jesus! Alright, so this Delamain cab seems to, uh... Oh, 
Be fucking crazy. Hi, GLaDOS. Hi, GLaDOS. I guess we both know what's going to happen next. Delamine misses you. Here to shut you down. Your specimen has been processed, and we are now ready to begin the test proper. <sighs> really appreciate it if you didn't make this difficult. I have a surprise waiting for you after this next test. Telling you would spoil the surprise. So I'll just give you a hint. I'm going to kill you, and all the cake is gone. Yep, that's straight up GLaDOS. That, that's straight up GLaDOS. And she st ate the cake! I honestly, truly didn't think you'd fall for that. Okay, that's enough! Either you shut down, or I'll turn you into a scrap heap. Here come the test results. You are a horrible person. Hey, thanks. I'm serious. That's what it says. A horrible person. We weren't even testing for that. Going back to Delamine really so scary, you gotta drag this out. I let you survive this long because I was curious about your behavior. Well, you've managed to destroy that part of me. A bitter, unlikable loner, whose passing shall not be mourned. You know, this psych eval might have felt more credible if you hadn't just tried to flatline me earlier. What's your point, anyway? Survival? You're still shuffling around a little. But believe me, you're dead. How do you... The talking is over. I'm going back. I've made contact with the missing vehicle. Definitely the Otis of the bunch. Yes, particularly impertinent, that one. A share of your fee is being processed. I don't know how I feel about that. How do these Delamains know about me, right? Like, how, how do the Delamains just know about what's going on with V? Also, based on the fact that there's uh, another Delamain nearby, I kind of want to take one. Just want to grab it real quick. Springs. So are there only two more Delamains left? Actually, no, 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 no. We're going to stop. I'm going to get over here, but then I'm going to stop. Um, how do the Delamains know about V? Like, one of them is like, knows way more. I don't know. It's weird. It's weird. We're gonna do one other, like one kind of last thing though, before we end off, and then I'll talk about what's going on tomorrow, again. So. Keep on running, keep on running. I just want to get to the, uh, to like the river bridge, and then, or like right outside where this Delamain uh, quest is. And then we'll be good. Keep on running, I keep on running, running. All right, cool. So I'm gonna do, I'm gonna check these shards real quick. Cause some of these could be encrypted. I just want to make sure I can get finish the encrypted ones real quick before we uh, do anything. So, 
so many conversations. But yeah, tomorrow, um, what we're going to do is once I get back from getting my oil changed in my car, I am going to stream some Genshin. We're just going to get uh, a lot of the stuff from Genshin taken care of with the new event that's going on. And then I'm going to go... Then I have to go to the dentist, so we do all that sort of shit. Um, which, once again, dentist stuff is not going to be too hard. What is going on here? This is all the tarot stuff. Gotcha. So, yeah. So, it's going to go um, wake up, do oil change sort of things. Come back here. We'll stream Genshin for a little bit, so I'll be actually in the middle of the day compared to at night. Then what we'll end up doing is... Stopping, I'm going to go dentist stuff. Like, I might have something going on after it, but we'll see. Otherwise, we'll do a Mori. And we'll do a Mori till the end of the prologue? I think it's. I think we'll go to the end of the prologue for a Mori. Maybe a little bit further. Mm. Excuse me. We'll see. We'll see. And then uh, tomorrow we'll also do My Time at Porsche. So we will get, we either do My Time with Porsche, mm, yeah, we'll probably do My Time with Porsche instead of Dead by Daylight, because then Friday is going to be Dark Souls, or Demon Souls, and My Time with Porsche, or not My Time with Porsche, Dead by Daylight, so yeah. Um, as far as Cyberpunk goes, like, there's still a few, there's still quite a few things I have to purchase, um... And I have a few more things to do, which is cool. Looks like there's two more domains to get, and then we have the main jobs. And then I just want to see real quick, what are we looking at with achievements here? Um, I'm worried about these hidden trophies, so what I'm going to do, I'm going to do this real quick. I'm going just to see... If there's anything that's like important to do. Um, okay, so hidden trophy wise, none of them made, well, most of them didn't make sense to me. wonder if some of these have to do with the endings. I'm not so sure. Collect all items that once belonged to Johnny Silverhand. I think we do that later. Watson, we haven't done yet. Haven't done yet. Pacifica, we're close to. Westbrook, Haywood. Actually, Westbrook and Haywood. Pacific. So we haven't done Pacifica yet. So there must be something we're missing in Pacifica. And then Watson. Let me, let me check here real quick. Let's check the map. So Pacifica is this area. So let's see what we're missing. Is there anything? I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna do a quick once over. Um, doesn't look like it, but it, it's possible that things might show up later. Yeah, for Pacifica. So there's that. What's, uh, let's see. Westbrook. So we haven't done everything in Westbrook, which makes sense because there's still, like, a few, like, tarot card things that we have to do and buying vehicles. So there's that. Watson is up here. Which also, like I said, has a few things, like we have the reported crime right there and such. So, and we have actual story quests. So there's not too much we have to worry about there. Let's just take a look here. Uh, city center, we haven't even touched yet, so no worries there. Reach max level in any skill. 
we're one away from body, so that's good. Buy all vehicles available for purchase. We need more money. Craft three legendary items. We're very close to doing that. Kill or incapacitate three enemies with one detonate grenade quick hack. Um, we can do this. I just need to get the detonate grenade quick hack, which I think is just from a Netrunner store. So hopefully I find I get one real quick. Uh, after reviving with second heart, I need to figure out which Ripper Dock gives me second heart. I'll look that up next time. Find the tarot cards and find all the fast travel stuff. So really, the only thing is I'm worried about are all these hidden trophies. Everything else should be easily gotten. And I just need to talk to Doge about a few things. So cool. Cool, cool, cool. Um, but with that, that's going to be everything regarding stream here tonight. So I thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed the stream. Uh, have a wonderful day, night, morning, afternoon, and or evening. Of course